All right, welcome everyone. Dave Ona here, along with Randy Kohler. We're at the Helping Hand Thrift Store in downtown Detroit Lakes, and uh, just playing a little game of checkers here. A little game of checkers. <laughs> you can't beat that. Can't tell you the last time that I played that. I am. Um, uh, you can tell exactly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so, well, you uh, folks here at uh, the thrift store just uh, celebrated your first anniversary last weekend, and uh, I was down here for a couple of hours uh, during the day. And uh, what a great grouping of folks that you had stopping by. I was wondering if it was the food or the anniversary that kept you, because you really hung out for more, better part of the day. Well, it was fun. It you, was you, fun. You uh, were uh, featured on a live broadcast on yeah. our sister stations, and, and uh, certainly appreciate that. And yeah. uh, just a lot of people were aware of what was going on here, and and uh, like like uh, you'd mentioned earlier, one of uh, the bigger days in in the store's existence. Yeah, we were we're so grateful for all the people with the polar plunge going on and. And all the events that were going on on, on that Saturday, um, we were really impressed with the amount of people that showed up. We had a full store all day. We had lots of uh, drawings, a drawing every hour. Mm -hmm. um, we featured this checkerboard as an option for people. And we had tacos in a bag. And, and the, most, the, the, the most awesome part was is all the people that showed up. And we got to communicate with them and find some things out about them and share with them about the refuge and the Compassion House and what we're doing. And, and that day with uh, Light and Broadcasting giving us a, a day of uh, live broadcasting, it really it really showed what that means and what it can do. It was fun to be down here and, and things. So it was, it was yeah. a, a good day for all. It so was. We're sitting toward the back of the store. Uh, remind the folks once again, you've got cards and stuff in the store now. Yeah, our new Fairly addition new. Is, is our cards. Mm -hmm. and we have a huge card collection back here, so I encourage people to come in and shop for their cards. And I want to remind people that every day, throughout the day, they're constantly putting things out onto the shelves. We have a, a neighbor business owner who comes in three, four times a day just to see what the new things that were put out on, so he can be the first ones to have a chance at it. It really does change. I notice that from week to week, and you know, especially if we happen to be uh, on you know location uh, away from here for a couple of weeks, there really is a whole different look to the store. Furniture is moved around and yeah. and and uh, restocked. So they really do a great job with all that. That's for sure. Let's take a quick break, Randy, and uh, we'll be right back. Okay, hey, welcome back. We're here at the Helping Hand Thrift Store in downtown Detroit Lakes, and and uh, we've mentioned before how the thrift store is one of the funding mechanisms for the overall ministries of the refuge and the compassion yeah. house, and it's, yeah. it's fun to see how it all all works together. And we've even kind of molded into our, our melded uh, our daily bread program, which is our food ministry at the refuge, into the uh, thrift store. We have uh, we bring bread and we try to keep our bread supply stocked up here and we get goodies that come in and different things in abundance and we bring them over to the thrift store so not only are you shopping for great deals you get to take home free bread and that's an ongoing kind of thing and certain days I think you mentioned during yeah, the week are here here at the thrift store they have it every day but at the refuge Wednesdays and Fridays are our fresh bread days and that's when we put out our fresh bread uh, baked goodies at the uh, that we get and you never know what we're going to get. Sometimes we get a lot of dairy supplies and salads and fruits and vegetables. So Wednesdays and Thursdays are Wednesdays and Fridays at the refuge from 10 to 2 are the key moments or times and anybody can come in anytime if they're in need and we'll help them all. Okay. Let's mention the Solid Grounds Coffee Shop once again. That's a, uh, just a friendly, cozy little spot. We filmed there a number of times. And, yes. Uh, find people for people to gather and chat and fellowship and, and enjoy. And that's at 921 Southeast A Street. And also the phone number there is 847-1982. And you can call in and put in an order, order in advance and drive through our drive through window and pick okay. it up. And that opens at 7 in the morning, right? Opens at 7 in the morning. The lunch uh, is from 11 to 4. Okay, okay. So that, and that's really going well and we're happy and, and that's a good time. And, and that helps fund also the refuge and all the, the parts of our ministry as well as we're moving forward on our Compassion House when we have our feeding program, which is Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Come on in and get a meal from 5 to 6.30, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. We have a different church group every, every evening uh, cooking our meals. And, uh, and then we stay tuned to our webpage, uh, therefugeofdl.org, and our, uh, like us on Facebook, and you can find out about all the other programs that we have going on. And vol volunteer opportunities oh. uh, abound, and, and they should contact you. 
Uh, Come on in. Find out. Give us a call, 847-1982, and sign up to be a volunteer at one of our locations. Thanks, Randy, and thank you for watching, folks, and uh, we'll look forward to seeing you again next week. God bless, and have a good day.